All right, guys. So people have been asking for us to drop a brand new episode of the new to pro series. So today we're going to be doing that and showing you guys how to max out that star pass, guys, so easily. All you're going to need is one unit, guys. Yes, sir. That's right. You know what? You don't even need this orb on her. You know, I'll just unequip the orb because it's probably going to confuse you. All you need is this one unit here, or if you have other units, um, uh, that will work as well. Any unit with a cheap upgrade cost and a fast SPA should do the trick. I'm using Sword Maid 2 because uh, let's just say she's one of the easiest units to get, and I totally recommend her because she's you can use her to solo a bunch of things. So uh, this is what you're gonna want to do, guys. All right. So there's two methods. One, if you if you're on, if you're able to AFK, and uh, two, if you're not able to AFK. All right. So uh, first up, we'll go if you can't AFK. If you can't AFK, there's only one way to do this, and that is this right here, guys. You want to go beat these three missions. So let's go beat these three missions real quick, and I'll show you guys exactly what we get, and then I'll show you guys the OP AFK method. All right, let's get it. All right, for this part, we need to have a legendary lineage unit and re one eye. So uh, we got both of those in the inventory, and uh, yeah, let's get it cracking, guys. All right. All right, so I finished getting the kills with Re1. <laughs> Remember, this unit is mainly good for uh, the the orb raids. Um, what is it? Random boss rush. Everything else, trash for. All right, now we're just gonna get our kills with our legendary lineage unit, Gojo, and also get to that wave 50. So remember guys, these quests are usually really easy to beat. The only time it sucks is when you have like a really bad unit that you left in your inventory and it's like kill 300 units with a unit that does 10 damage. All right, those ones kind of suck and I sometimes skip those. Also, thankfully they fixed the one where it used to say like you had to do PVP. Since they removed PVP, thankfully they fixed those quests. So uh, let's go uh, beat all this and I'll show you guys how much XP it gives you. And then I'll show you guys the OP AFK method. All right, there we go. So we just finished all of those tasks. We were at star pass level one. Let's see how much we got. All right. Oh, dang it. Wait, auto replay actually worked for one. So auto replay works in infinite mode, guys, but not in other modes. Interesting. Keep note of that, guys. All right. So here we go, guys. Let's quickly complete our tasks as well. Hey, we'll get some damage too when we do this. So star pass, we jumped all the way up to eight. What? Yo, wow, you don't even need AFK, man. Dang, in one day, we went from, wow, okay then, all right, uh, chill then, okay, um, maybe the AFK method isn't necessary, guys, uh, that's a little bit OP, I'm not gonna lie, from one infinite mode match, we got up to, s from one to eight, all righty, well, to that, now I'm gonna show you guys the new, um, uh, best method, now there's actually two methods you can do, uh, one is in story mode, um, it's the same strategy. You just have to hit the replay button. But the thing is, auto replay does not work in story mode, guys. All right? It does not. So what that means is you're going to have to go into infinite mode if you want to AFK the star pass. All right? And you're going to have to get pretty high in infinite mode. But the nice thing is you're going to only need to bring one unit. Also, don't mind idle in our inventory. Um, huh. <laughs> Well, I'll show you us getting her in a different episode, all right? Uh, unfortunately, uh, I was going to film a different episode of this today, but uh, we're, we're, we're still down bad guys for Blackbeard in the banner. So uh, please, somebody DM me if they see Blackbeard or Whitebeard in the banner. Like, we really need them. So uh, let's go hop on into infinite mode. I'm going to excel you guys at the strategy. This strategy is very, very OP. So uh, let's get in. All right, before we hop in, though, I'm definitely going to tell you of some things to recommend. All right, first up, you want to have a unit with a fast SPA. Now, again, pretty much <laughs> the unit I recommend is Sword Maid, all right? She's really, really good for this. And you're going to need a cup one. Uh, you're going to need some software, guys, all right? And also, you need to make sure you have your auto replay on. Now, if you want to, you can do the easy strategy and just use, um, uh, yeah. You can, there's two methods. So we're going to use Tiny Task. All right, so Tiny Task setup is pretty simple, guys. All right. <laughs> a little bit of a leak there for y'all. Whoa, what about you guys liking that? You want to get my code unit? A little little preview if anybody even watches the videos. All right, so uh, go to preferences, playback speed, 1x is fine, 2x is fine, and then make sure you guys have continuous playback set, all right? If you don't have continuous playback set, you're going to be down bad. All right, also I like to have my recording hockey set, so I have F8 and then play hockey. I usually just press the play button. All right, here we go, guys. So you're going to want to select, hmm, um, honestly, I personally like to do regular mode. So we're just going to go select regular and then start. Remember, we have auto replay on and auto wave skip on. All right, now this is going to be a very, very easy macro. 
Now, I personally recommend you do extreme mode. It gives you more XP. But if not, it's all good too. So uh, we're going to press F8 to record. All right. Then press one click. All right. One click. And then extreme. And then you're going to want to click unit. Click upgrade unit. Click, click, upgrade. All right. Click, click, upgrade. All right. I'll do that one more time for you guys. All right. So record, click extreme mode, click here, click here, click here, place, click, and then the upgrade button, all right? It's pretty simple, all right? And you wanna place down two of them, okay? So you're gonna have two of these guys placed, and then of course you're gonna stop the recording, and you're gonna let that ride, all right? So I'm gonna show you guys exactly what that macro will do, and how much we're gonna gain in the star pass. Remember, we are in star pass eight. So uh, now usually you're gonna end up with two of her maxed out. All right, so I'll place one down. All right, it'll probably upgrade it first, to be honest. So, uh, and remember, there is no powerful twos. So, I guess we'll do the worst case scenario. It accidentally places two. So, you'll, you'll have two placed down, and then the powerfuls will eventually show up. All right. Now, this is a lot easier as well if you have 3x game speed on, guys. Um, but I know uh, we're noobs here. We don't have 3x game speed, which is a bit unfortunate, but, you know, that's life. All right, and then, of course, we get an upgrade with, the, with a thing. All right, so remember the macro is this, guys. All right, I'll show it to you again. All right, click, 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 and then you want to go place another one. Click, click, click. All right, and that's the macro. All right, perfect. Now I accidentally clicked somewhere else on the macro, so we're just gonna let that ride. All right, there we go. You're gonna see exactly what the macro is doing. Click, click, click. All right, click, click, click 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 make there you go perfect guys so this is what the macro does so uh you, you guys are gonna see the macro working so uh, i'll see you guys in a couple seconds all right let me go uh, stop the macro real quick i think it's f12 all right there we go all right now what it's gonna do is it's probably gonna eventually um uh, max upgrade two of these so we'll show it like that so that's gonna get you to a pretty high wave so i'm just gonna skip ahead to a little bit farther where it maxes everything out and i'll show you guys what happens uh, like at the end of the at the end of the match and how all that works all right so give it a second also one thing to note you can change out the unit etc but make sure you guys get to at least a decent wave i'd say like wave 15 to wave 20. if you get to a wave less than 15 it doesn't count towards the star pass so make sure you guys get a decent wave and you can bring other units besides sword maid all right i just like to use sword maid because i know pretty much everybody has her and if you summon in the in the banner enough you'll get her and she's uh she's pretty easy to get and for some reason i always end up with her on my new to pro account all right, so this is what you're gonna end up with the macro two max out sword maids all right so we're just gonna wait for us to die it's gonna take a second but we are in extreme mode right so uh, it won't take us that long for it to happen i'm pretty sure we did click extreme all right they don't have that much hp oh uh, yeah they'll get up there in a second and they'll they'll easily get past but you're gonna see we're doing quite a bit of damage so they're not gonna die till a little bit later on now if you want to die sooner just bring a weaker unit and you should die sooner it might be a little bit faster all right, so it looks like the strategy is going to get you to... Oh, wow, I guess we're still alive. Um, Let's see here. I guess it's going to get you to about wave 50 every time, which is pretty not... It's not bad at all, guys. It's going to get you a ton of XPs as well. So uh, let's see how far we get. However, usually it's better to die sooner, but I think they patched that. So hopefully um, uh, it still makes sense to die this late. But I will show you guys a way faster method right after this that I probably recommend more. But the thing is, that one requires the replay to work and uh like because auto replay doesn't work in story so let me show you guys a little bit faster of a method real quick right after this all right there we go guys we're about to die perfect all right so this will auto replay all right but we're gonna have to go return you saw the auto replay worked so uh, we're gonna go to return and we're gonna see how much we got on our star pass all right so uh let's see what we got on our star pass there we go so the problem with this is you're gonna get basically a guaranteed tier every time so you just gotta do that a hundred times and overnight you can pretty much do that so you will be able to get it very very fast all right so not bad at all but let me show you guys a little bit faster of a method so uh let's go over there to story mode and you're just gonna bring the same exact unit all right same exact unit and honestly this one is really easy you can do it one of two ways so uh, let's hop in there real quick and also the nice thing about this method is it does give you uh gems and i believe it does give you a ton of gold as well so if you're trying to afk gold farm this is the way to go so you're just going to want to select beginner saga and then you're going to want to select number six all right this is going to give you the most amount of gold on the first map so let's do that real quick all right click start and then we're going to just enter in the game and get your tiny whip out your tiny task now you can make a tiny task really simple for this one 
but uh, this one's a little actually this is a little bit harder than the other ones but yeah so you see the everything all right here we go so record all right click extreme click 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 all right then click click and then uh, click where the replay button is which is right about here and then stop the recording and uh turn on 2x speed all right we're gonna save the recording as well for story mode all right and then we're gonna click play and let's let it ride guys let's go see how this is doing oh man perfect perfect all right we don't have enough money but looking good guys all right so it looks like this is gonna be a pretty good method right now so uh, let's go fast forward a little bit and see how it progresses all right let me go stop the recording real quick oh that might happen guys oh that's unfortunate that happens yeah make sure you don't have that up uh, yeah well make sure you click the right spot all right sometimes it might bug all right maybe you want to put a little a click here yeah if you do it right the cancel button should click as well now this is personally the method i would use um because i do believe it's a lot faster than the infinite mode method all right so uh, let's skip to the end wave 15 and we'll see it now you have to make sure you click the replay button guys all right sometimes it's hard to nail down that exact spot so it might take you a couple tries and there is another one i like to use i forget what it's called i think it's gs auto clicker yeah gs auto clicker i like to use that one as well guys so i uh, make sure you guys i think i have it all, i forget if i still have it all right do i still have a gs auto clicker um all right maybe i don't have i think it was called what was i forget what it's called but uh, i had yeah gs auto clicker is very good as well all right that one helps you like narrow it down a little bit better so i definitely recommend checking out gs auto clicker if you don't have if you um uh, don't like tiny task all right let's keep uh, going on this macro all right there we go guys we're on wave 15. all right let's see how it handles the end of the wave so we're gonna press it again all right let's see if it's gonna click the replay button all right hopefully i help okay make sure it clicks in the right spot i'll give it a second oh and i have to click skip through that there you go see it clicks the replay button. oh man did it click it all right well it should click the replay button all right again sometimes it takes a second to fix all right it'll click the replay button and then it'll just run the whole macro back and uh, basically you just let that run overnight and you should be good to go and you can see how fast that was 300 seconds without uh, the speed all right perfect so uh let's uh okay okay actually it did work it did it did click the replay i don't know sometimes it bugs or whatever but make sure you click the replay button all right we're gonna stop oh there you go it did work hmm, nice all right it, it's kind of bugged though so it is what it is all right so uh let's go hop in and see how much we got from that all right also it might even get you a good amount of levels so uh there we go guys okay so sometimes it doesn't get you a full level from story mode but infinite nearly always gives you a full level from my experience so it's gonna take you a little bit longer also guys it's a lot harder to get to the tiers once you're like a higher level um but these missions they're guaranteed to give you at least one star pass level from my experience so uh, i think for this new to pro series we're just gonna do no afk strategy or minimal afk and we're gonna just try to beat all the missions every day and that should get you to be able to beat the star pass in plenty of time this star pass is gonna pretty much last a while i would say probably at least another th two or three months so if you guys want to get Aaron or the seven stars, that's your best bet. And uh, yeah, guys, please let me know, man. We really need Blackbeard to show up in the banner because we're down bad. It's really hard for me to film without a slow unit. So pray for Blackbeard and Whitebeard in the banner so I can continue the new to pro series. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.